Hey guys, it's Rosie, welcome back. Tomorrow is my 16th birthday and I'm super excited. So um, my family has a lot of fun plans um, just to stay at home and be safe but still kind of have a fun birthday. So I'm gonna bring you guys along. Um, it is like eight o'clock I think, so I'm gonna be going to bed soon. I'm gonna probably watch a show with my mom and then um, maybe read and then go to bed. So I will see you guys in the morning, but I just wanted to make the intro to this video, so I will see you on my birthday. Good morning guys, it is my birthday, officially. Um, I am so tired. I don't know why I woke up at 4 a.m. It is 6 a.m. now. I laid in bed and watched TikToks and read and tried so hard to go to sleep, but I could not. For the past like four or five nights, I've been waking up at five, but four is new, so I don't appreciate that. And I went to bed at 10. That's later than I normally go to sleep, so I don't know, but it's my birthday, so I'm not going to worry about it. And I think we're gonna go downstairs and make waffles or something. I'm pretty sure that was the first thing on our plan. We made a whole like um, birthday schedule because um, we do have a few things planned. Um, and also Shawn Mendes is performing on BBC at 7 a.m. I think, so that should be pretty fun. Um, so I think I'm gonna go down and see my parents, see how they're doing. So I will see you guys in a bit. I just listened to Shawn Mendes' performance on BBC. It's so kind of him to perform on my birthday, um, but it was really good. So now I'm going to be studying for uh, my written test for my driver's license, which I will be taking in like three hours. So fun. So I got dressed, my mom and I went on a walk. Um, I did a little bit of makeup, just mascara and my eyebrows. And I had a Zoom call with my aunt to open my first gift. So we're going to be going to the DMV soon um, so I can take my uh, written test for my driver's license. So should be fun. But yeah, we're going to leave pretty soon. So... at Shake Shack. Also I passed my written exam so that was really cool. Back here we have a package from Guitar Center. Um, for my birthday my parents got me the case that goes to my new guitar. I will be doing a birthday haul to show you guys everything that I got but that is just one of the things and we had to pick it up. I also got the mac and cheese for tonight's dinner. Um, I'm super excited about that. We've got a take and bake so we don't have to come all the way out here again to get it tonight for dinner. So. I'm very excited about that and yeah, we're going to be going home pretty soon. My dad's just grabbing a few things from an auto parts store. So yeah. Okay, I need to show the camera. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Rosie. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh. 
We're not going out. <laughs> It is now the next day, but a lot happened yesterday, so I kind of want to explain kind of what we did. Um, so, of course, we went to the DMV in the morning after I kind of filmed a lot in the morning and then not so much later on as we got busier. So we went to the DMV and I passed my um, written exam for my driver's license, and now I have to wait until December to do the practical road exam, so I'm kind of annoyed by that, but whatever, there's not really anything I can do about it. Um, but then we went on and we went to Shake Shack in Boston, um, which was super, super delicious. And then we went to Guitar Center to pick up one of my gifts. And we went on a few other errands. We picked up the mac and cheese for dinner also. And then we came home and had to quickly open gifts because um, there was something that I did not know about that was going to happen. My parents were like, oh, I don't know. We don't want to miss it, whatever. And um, so I had to open my gifts really fast because there was one of the gifts that I had to open before we went there. So I opened the gift and it turns out that um, my parents leased a horse for me for the next two months. So the horse that I've been riding in lessons. And I had a lease time at 2.30 so I ended up going and riding and it was so much fun. And I'm now going to be riding four days a week instead of just one. So it's going to be really great. Um, it's been so much fun already, so I can't wait for um, riding today. So after that, um, I had been having calls all day with family members. My mom was setting up like calls with different people, and that was very thoughtful of her. Um, and I picked up my friend, and she came over, and we had a fire, and we ate cake, and ate mac and cheese. Then we watched 16 Candles, which I really enjoyed, um, even though I just saw it in the summer. Um, it's a nice movie. I like it. And what else did we do? Um, and then we kind of just went to bed, so it was a really, really fun day. It was very different than the last birthdays I've had. My mom and I were looking through pictures and apparently I haven't been home on my birthday in six years, which is really, really weird. Last year we were in London and it was so much fun, but um, of course you couldn't do that this year. So if you haven't seen the London vlog from last year, actually there were three videos because I was just having so much fun there. I videoed so much. Um, make sure to check those out because those are still some of my favorite content, I think. I just love my travel videos um, the most out of my content, I think. Um, but, and then years before that, we'd just been to Florida, um, even just going up north, and I did not remember that it's been so long that I haven't been home. So it's really different than what I'm pretty used to, but it was really nice. And I think we made the best of kind of what we were able to do with um, the coronavirus situation so I'm hoping sometime soon we'll be able to travel but of course not until it's safe so I think we did a great job being safe but still having fun so I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my sweet 16 birthday video vlog um, so make sure to check out those London vlogs and basically any other of my like travel content I love it so much and I know it's a great way to kind of escape what we are doing right now with being kind of in quarantine still. Um, so make sure to check out my social media at Rosie Revolts and my Etsy shop also at Rosie Revolts and my book at GhettoTouristBook.com. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye!